so when you describe your treatment of adjustments, you were describing the disc. Mm -hmm. Are you are you adjusting the disc or are you adjusting the vertebrae? Good, good, both? good detailed question. We're adjusting the vertebrae. By adjusting the vertebrae, we can decompress the disc initially to allow the pressure relief. At that point, your spine normally has movement to keep that pressure in the disc down. When the spine locks up for, for we'll talk about other reasons too, at that point, the spine locks up, the disc over time builds up pressure, and it has to release it somehow. Sometimes it'll bulge out to the nerve root to make that nerve root fire, causing your pain, causing your symptoms, numbness, tingling, whatever it is. At that point, we decompress it to minimize those symptoms by causing the motion of the spine. Okay, so... Uh, I get that. So let's talk a little bit. I'm, I'm going to stay in geek mode just a little bit good, longer. Good. So uh, what I'd like to know is, you know, what are the common uh, vertebral issues that you're adjusting that are causing this increase in disc pressure? What's going well, on there? The change in pressure. We're causing the bones to actually move and cap, they call it cavitate, like popping your knuckles to leave that pressure out of the spine. And by doing that, now the spine can actually move it because the spine is, it has a natural motion. It can go back to its natural state and over time stay there. And what we want to do is make sure that space stays open long enough for the space to relearn how to stay loose. So we work on posture, work on things down the line that we work, we'll talk about posture also to get that body to heal and stay loose. Once you decrease that pressure, then it allows the thing to open itself up and stay loose over time by adding things like like uh, you want to call it consistent stretching, long-term stretching, holding a stretch so that space can decompress and stay open. Because realize the spine, wants it, <clears throat> once that nerve fires, that whole spine wants to guard tight. Like anything in our body, it's going to tighten, shorten. If it's been there long enough, that's its new normal. We're trying to make the, this now to calm down, we calm the nerve down, now can potentially stretch by doing it manually, by us doing it with the adjustment, but also doing it, if you want to call it, her patient's uh, compliance is get them to stretch, do things on their own. So we can stretch that, let that no normal motion back to normal. That point becomes their optimal normal, not what they're used to.